to just do literally a swipe and done, you could do that and make your brown eyes pop. Hey guys, welcome to my channel. Thank you so much for joining me today. I hope that you are all doing very well. So today's video, how to make your brown eyes pop. You know, when I think about brown eyes, I think about, um, it is an eye color that is very common. Obviously, I have brown eyes. I have I have dark brown eyes. Um, it's the most common eye color. The nice and unique thing, though, about that is brown eyes tend to look good in any pigment. But when I think about really making them pop, I think of greens, I think of purples, I think of golds. Um, those are colors that I personally like to use to kind of make the, to make my eyes kind of have a statement. In this video, I'm gonna use the Milani Gilded Flora Palette. It's a beautiful palette, um, and it's kind of got the best of a couple of these colors that I mentioned, these pigments, because you've got your purples, um, and then you've got your kind of your golds and your browns over here, and then you've got some really nice pinks. This palette's nice, it's drugstore. You can get it at Ulta. You can probably even like use a coupon and, um, but I think I bought mine from Walmart and I want to say it was about 15 bucks. This was like six months ago when this palette first came out. So I'm not really sure um, with the, if the price has gone up a little bit, but it's great quality um, palette and it's really beautiful. You do not have to have this particular palette in order to make your brown eyes pop. Just get any palette that has the colors that you like and then just swipe a little bit of glitter on that lid. So I'm gonna do a look for you guys. The rest of my face, um, it, it's pretty much done with the exception of course of my eyes and my lips. Much, Thank you for subscribing to my channel if you haven't already. I really appreciate it. Thank you to my current subscribers. I appreciate you guys so much. Anyways, all right, so let's get into it. So I'm going to stick with this like section right over here and it's going to be simple. It's going to be easy. It doesn't have to be anything overly dramatic, but I'm just going to take a fluffy brush. This is the blinged brushes. Aren't they gorgeous? They're so beautiful. These are so, so pretty. Um, here it's called garden path. Yeah. Garden path. I'm going to have that as my transition. Can I put makeup on? without putting my hair back, I don't know. I see these YouTubers sometimes and they have like hair like all over the, and I'm just like, oh my God, put your, put your hair back. But they always end up doing a fabulous look. I'm like, do you have makeup in your hair? They're better than I am. Let's see. Can I put my hair back here real quick? Let's just put my hair back. Okay, there we go. Oh, it's, it's really light. Okay, I don't know. Okay, it looks just like my skin to, all right, okay. You know what, I'm just gonna put it all over the lid. It's so light, it just matches my skin, so. We're gonna go into salt of the earth. Perfect transition color. All right, so now I'm gonna take another a smaller fluffy brush and I'm just gonna start darkening up that crease. I'm gonna take this color here, it's called Take a Root. So now what I'm going to do is I'm going to take a little bit of glitter glue. If you don't have glitter glue, that's fine. You can always spray your brush um, and then dip into the pigment. But I'm going to take the glitter glue, put a little bit on my eyelid here. I think I'm just going to use my finger and I'm going to go into this color right here. It's called Botanist.
applying that to the entire lid. Okay, other eye, put some glitter glue. Now what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna take this color right here. It's called Petal. <laughs> Petal to the metal. <laughs> I was reading it upside down. I'm like, did I read that right? And apply it right to the middle of the lid. Pretty, gosh, this palette is so pretty. Now, let's go back in there with that first fluffy brush. Let's kind of clean things up a little bit. If we need to add a little bit more color or um, pigment to the eye, which generally I usually do because sometimes I might have um, gotten glitter all up in the crease and stuff and which is fine just I want to you know clean things up just a little bit with the first color we use salt of the earth just go underneath the lower lash line real quick It looks a lot darker in the pan than what it really is. I also wanted to show you guys this too. Um, this is something by e.l.f. and it's the, looks like this. And, let me turn off my light. I mean, beautiful. If you wanted to pop that on the lid, let me show you on one of my eyes. Oh, it's so pretty. Oh, I think I like that that yellow better. It's called 24 karat. You guys see the difference? Still very beautiful. This is more a little bit more coppery. This one's a little bit more more um, gold, which I'm thinking I'm I'm digging. So I'm gonna go ahead and do it on this side. I think I paid like three bucks for this, but if you want to just do literally a swipe and done you could do that and make your brown eyes pop let's tight line a little bit let's make these eyes i'm just gonna tight line the top yeah that's that gold is really pretty i hope that you guys can see it i know i'm you know i say this every time I give props to my iPhone, my little iPhone. I don't have a fancy camera yet, um, but I'm very thankful for my little iPhone. The only problem is, is that you can't really, I can't really showcase how I would want a pigment to look because I don't have, you know, the best camera, but still it's good enough. It's good enough, you guys mascara on I'm gonna use the Too Faced better than sex mascara I do really like this stuff the wand is really good for my eyelashes it like grips them and um So I'm gonna go back in with Botanist and I'm gonna do highlight the inner corner. Okay, so now that's done. Now, we can take this, um, lost my train of thought before the liquid the liquid <laughs> it's a liquid um good pigment i'm gonna put just a dab right underneath right here okay you guys see it Last thing before I show you the final look, I want to do my lips and I just, you guys, I'm so excited. <laughs> I just bought this MAC lipstick in Snob. 
at TJ Maxx this morning. Beautiful pink color. I don't want too bold of a lip because I do want the eye to be um, the main attraction, basically, of my face. But I do love a brown look like this um, with a very bold, like, pink lip. Um, but let's do some. Oh, wait. No. Line my lips with a ColourPop lippy pencil. And it is in the color Good and Plenty. And then I am lined that with um, a Capari. This is just lip glossy. It's in birthday suit. So it's very like, um, very nude <laughs> for lack of better words, birthday suit. Um, it's very nude, but it's really, really pretty. All right, you guys, this is the final look, how to make your brown eyes pop. So thank you so much, you guys, for joining me for this video. Please like and subscribe. I'll put some other videos um, that I've done, maybe here, maybe here. I'll put my face up. You can click on my face. You can subscribe to my channel. Please comment below. Let me know if there is a technique that you guys use to make your brown eyes pop. And let me know if you want me to do any more colors, like, um, like I mentioned, the purple or the greens. Um, I'm happy to do that. So thank you guys so much. I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.